Today is a science experiment day. We are going to keep our record of 100% success on all science experiments. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> well, that was disappointing. <laughs> yes. So, what does a super soaker, methyl alcohol, and boric, away? boric acid, and a hanger, what, what does all that have in common? Fun. Can you show us how to assemble this fun? This experiment comes from the channel Backyard Scientist where he kind of shows you the chemicals that you use to make different colored flames. And then he also did a, a flamethrower too, right? Oh yeah. Step one, attach coat hanger. Real janky like. The methyl alcohol by itself should be a blue flame. Whoops. So we'll try that first. And then we'll add some other stuff to see if we can get it green. This is test shot one. That wasn't blue, but looks blue on the ground. Now we add the boric acid. Did he say how much? Um, no. He probably does say how much to add, but we, we we've didn't make a, it that far in the video. We've got a short attention span. <laughs> Light the paper. Ooh. That's pretty cool. <laughs> hey, I think the seals are pretty much dead on it. It's not holding any more liquid that's why you get a cheap walmart gun <laughs> and now this is the next step I broke my hanger that was craig's fault and that's the guts. The pump is down in here. That's the trigger down there. It comes up and it releases the valve up here at the front. And you got the particle accelerator right here. <laughs> Does this one have a rotary girder on it? Yep, right here where it spins. That's the rotary girder. Mm -hmm. Well, that's a super soaker. A super soaker knockoff, that is. Real super soakers probably have like... It's an adventure force, Dan. <laughs> adventure a, force. A real super soaker would have had like titanium parts in there and stuff. Well built. Nope. Do we have another bottle of that stuff? I think so. This stuff is water remover. We want to see if it'll remove the water from the tank. We need to clean the tank out, so we need to empty you, it, right? We need to remove the water, yep. You've done it this way before, right? Oh, yeah. This bottle sucks. Stir it around a little bit. false advertising <laughs> anyhow uh, if you want to make your own flamethrower do it at your friend's house don't try this at your house <laughs> yeah and uh, if anybody asks you you didn't learn how to do it from us it was backyard scientist uh, that taught you how to do that and yeah <laughs> <laughs>